Oh, I just farted. Now that's not a great start, is it? Hi everyone! <coughs> Maybe not. Hi everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. So I have a little bit of explaining to do. I'm gonna insert this clip in front of a vlog that you're about to watch because I don't really know what the hell it is. So you may have noticed, or maybe not, no one really cares that much, I don't think. But I haven't posted on this channel in probably two weeks now. I basically went home to Sheffield and I was talking about going home to Sheffield in the last vlogs, which is really annoying. I was mentioning that I was going home for a little while. I planned on going home for a week and then a lot happened and I didn't go home for just a week. Basically, I planned on coming back down after a week, like I just said, and then the day I was meant to arrive back in London, Paz and Freya both went away. So I would have been coming back down to London with no one being here. So I ended up actually staying home until yesterday, which yesterday was Sunday, today's Monday. Hopefully the day you're watching this is Monday as well. But I obviously tried to vlog whilst I was home and it just didn't really work. I feel like I had my camera everywhere I went with me. I really felt like this time when I went home, I really just prioritized spending time with my friends and family. Where I used to just throw away all the footage that didn't really make a cohesive vlog. However, I met my friends from college after like two years. I spent a lot of time with my friends and my family like I said I saw the dogs so I just don't want to throw the footage away so I'm kind of putting it here for not only you to enjoy watching hopefully but for me just to keep and have here forever so then if I ever need to look back on it or want to look back on it I can do and it's there and it's just a place that doesn't clog up all my memory on my laptop basically so yeah I'm gonna roll the clips that I filmed this weekend April is a really busy month we're going to Harry Potter World tomorrow which I'm obviously gonna vlog all that we then are going to well Jazz and Sophie are coming down at the end of the week I'm going to an event with Anna this weekend I and then next weekend is Big Beauty Day at Manchester Big Beauty Day at London and then we got Shawn Mendes the week after we're just doing a bunch of stuff this month so stay tuned for the vlogs. I'm gonna try and vlog as much as I can. I do apologize for not vlogging much whilst I'm home. It always, always happens just because I hate shoving a camera in my mom and dad's faces, especially when I've not seen them in the longest time. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna start rambling. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. If you do, smash a big thumbs up, subscribe, and I will be back with more content soon. Hey, my name is Junior, and you're really handsome. Come and put your hands. We've done this before. All right, so I'm back home from uni now. I've literally just packed up my suitcase. This is actually so full and really excessive, but I've booked a ticket home and I don't actually have a return ticket booked, so I don't know how long I'm gonna stay. That's the tea, that's the situation. I am gonna finish packing and then I get to see my dogs. I actually don't get back into Sheffield until midnight and Ella is actually picking me up from the airport. From the airport. From the train station. Uh, and then I'm gonna go home, obviously. I can't wait to see Ella and Megan. I can't wait to see my dogs. I can't wait to see my mum and dad and my brother. I'm just really excited to go home, you know? <laughs> All right, so I'm all dressed and ready to go now. This is what I'm wearing to travel home in. Obviously, I'm gonna get back at midnight, so I decided to go in something cozy. My case is all packed right there. My bag is all packed right there. I think I've pretty much got everything. I have an hour now until my train actually departs, so I need to head to the train station. It only takes me like half an hour, maybe like 25 minutes to get there. So I'm gonna head out the door now. I just need to um, get my other bags and stuff, and then I'm literally gonna, gonna head off to the station. Right, we've come into a Chinese restaurant and we're currently practicing how to use the chopsticks because I said the last person to not give up or like the person to finish their whole meal with chopsticks wins. We don't win anything, but my brother's just getting a crash course on chopsticks from my mum who's the whitest woman I've ever seen in my life. Tell me to taste a dirty trip. Oh, you're, you've got fresh ones. Swap, add one of mine. <laughs> so, so, no bad at all. <laughs> 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 
Good morning everyone, or should I say good afternoon? It's literally just gone 12 and I have had so much done this morning. Basically, I don't know why I woke up so early. I woke up at like 6.30 and I couldn't get back to sleep. I think it's because everyone in my house wakes up super, super early. So when like my brother gets up for school and stuff at like 7 a.m., I'm obviously sharing a room with my brother so I hear him get up and it wakes me up. And my parents are all up super early. I just think my household back at home is super lively very early on in the morning and I just for some reason cannot sleep past it. It's even harder when you have 100 million dogs running and jumping on you in the morning so you physically have to be awake, you know? That being said, I'm not complaining because I've got so much done. Like I said, it's literally just gone 12 in the afternoon. I have edited up a full video that I needed to get done. I have also been replying to some emails all morning. I have had my breakfast. I'm starving again. So I'm gonna go downstairs and make myself some food. Morning, everyone. Or afternoon, you sleepy bad. Cutie, cutie, you sleepy bad. Cutie, cutie, you sleepy bad. Hola, senoritas. I look like fucking shit. We've arrived in town with the girls. Smile, ladies. Mother, you always have that dumb face of yours on my vlog. And you're gonna regret that one day when that comes to bite you in arse when you're on Love Island and you've got all these bad faces. <laughs> Why are you always there? I actually look the foulest mess I ever did know. All right, everyone, so it has been a little while now. We've actually been to town. I didn't really film much. We went in a few vintage shops. I wanted to do like a thrift store vlog. There's some really cool thrift shops in Sheffield that aren't like super overly priced. However, there were nothing in there and everything I find in thrift shops is too big or too small. Like, I never find anything that I like that actually fits me, which is really annoying. I tried some really cool jeans on, but they were like two sizes too big. And also I saw a really cool like vintage night hoodie. And guess what? That was too small. So so we just weren't winning in the clothes department today. However, we are now on our way to Meadow Hall because we're gonna go to the cinema. We were gonna go to the cinema in town. We're gonna watch the film Us. It's called Us, right? I think it's called And. Shut up. I thought this film were called And, so I'm sat there like, oh my God, we're gonna see this And film. And Ella's like, why would a film be called And? It's called Us, it looks really good. I haven't actually watched the trailer properly. I tried to watch it in Starbucks just then, but I couldn't really watch it because it was kind of loud in there, so I haven't really watched the trailer. The little um, cinema like poster thing that they have looks really cool, so I really am excited to see it. And it's made by the same people as Get Out, and Get Out was such a good film. Anyway, we went into town. I bought a little hat from a shop that I follow on Instagram. I'd wanted this hat for the longest time. I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna buy it, so I did. Boys and girls. Uh, my lips are so damn dry. Ella's got a new car and there's actually nowhere to put my camera. So if my vlogs are shit, blame Ella's new car. <laughs> Look at that, you same shape as my head. <laughs> it actually is. <laughs> hi everyone, so we're early for once. I don't know why I'm saying hi again, like I've not introduced this vlog already, but we literally have like 25 minutes before the film starts, which is rare when it comes to me and Ella. So I thought I would show you the hat I just bought. As you can see by the packaging. Don't know if you know this brand. One of my favorite brands. I actually think Off-White, Balenciaga are my favorite designers ever. And then Louis Vuitton, but I only like some Louis Vuitton things. Like Virgil's collection is really, really cool. Anyway, as you all know, I always wear hats. I either wear this beanie or my Supreme hat, like all the time. And I'm getting really bored of it. I tried to buy a new beanie the other day. And did it really work? No, because it's not black. So I don't know what I was thinking, as you can see. It's just a little black hat. It's off-white. It says cap on the front. I think that's really cool. So yeah, I picked up a new hat. Hopefully I'm gonna wear it a lot. I think Alfie Days has got this actually. I think that's the first place I ever saw it. I thought it was really cool. I was gonna sit and try and justify my purchase then, but I'm actually not gonna because I feel like it's annoying when every YouTuber does that. Can you um, try it on? Try it on. Mm. Uh, it's a piece. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so. Oh no, it's not bad actually. <laughs> oh no, that's better. You can adjust it. Yeah. Do you actually not like it? No, I do like it. Why do I just always look like a baby? We're in the cinema, ladies, and we're on time. Look who's in my house. Bye. <laughs> I haven't even vlogged this entire time. How bad? Okay, hi, let's give you the kiss note. So I was supposed to be in Manchester, didn't work out. I got locked out of my friend's house. So I came here. I've been here less than 24 hours. But I came. New vlog title. <laughs> 24 hour challenge. 24 hour challenge in both house. I saw Maddie and Ella. I went to KFC. We all went to McDonald's. We came back. We played with dogs. And now I'm leaving again. Cliff notes. And I'm going to meet my friends from college. That's so crazy and quirky. I haven't vlogged anything, but that's the update. Freya has been in my house for approximately 19 hours. Yeah, and she's going to leave. Wrong. So we're I just going to go to town now. But we're going to rush. I don't know if I miss this damn train. Tee <laughs> I've come to take Freya to the station. She's off back to Manchester. A true Mancunian. That's what they call it. <laughs> I'm 
sorry. Seeing you, seeing you, seeing you, seeing you. So just quickly before this video actually does end, I just quickly want to come in and say I am going to be at London and Manchester's Big Beauty Day Out. If you're not familiar with what Big Beauty Day Out is, it's basically like some in the city, VidCon. It's just a YouTube convention with a lot of Instagrammers, YouTubers, people online where we can go and like hang out with you all. I'll leave a link to the tickets and the website in the description. It happened last year, I was meant to go, but I actually fell ill on the day. So a bunch of my friends are going. I'm going, like I said, there's a London date, there's a Manchester date, and it's literally in like two weeks time. So if you want to come, grab your tickets. I feel like I've not really promoted that I'm going, but it's the first ever event that I'm actually on the lineup for. Possibly me and Haz, maybe doing a meetup. Who knows? I'll leave a link below. Check it out, make your mind up. That's the situation. Thanks for watching. I love you a lot, and I'll see you in a few days' time. Bye. Bye, horse. <laughs>